In Rocket League, the skill difference in players at the highest level is so minimal that any small advantage a team can get will go a long way in their success. And recently, Squishy was talking on a stream about certain boosts in the game that are nearly impossible to see by an opponent. And that's important because it makes it harder to read what they're doing in the air. One of the boosts is completely free to use for everybody. It's called Bubbles. So at least everyone has access to it. And there have been OCE pros in the past that use Bubbles quite a lot because of this knowledge. There are a few other boosts like this, another one being Black Ion Boost, which I'll show later in the video. But I thought I'd play a couple matches with Squishy to try out the Bubbles Boost and see how broken it can be. Should these boosts be banned in competitive play? Who knows, but let's give it a shot. Hope you guys enjoy. All right, we're giving Bubbles Boost a try with Squishy. See how it feels, because it, it's going to feel very different to Alpha, and I think it's going to look different to players. That's a first goal right there. Beautiful start. Yeah, Alpha Cap from Turbo's Cheeks. Professional player. Drive is also a very good player. He plays a lot of twos. I don't really see him at the high, high level too much. Looks like Squishy might get his boost taken here. I got no boost to my my name. Wait, Alpha Cup took our corner and the mid. What the heck is going on? I'm gonna back off here. I need boost if I can finally get one here. Be a save. Nice. Stay close here. Little touch. He just keeps pre jumping. I respect that. Be all right. It should be squishy to the back. Get the back corner boost. I can get some boost here. Oh, what a touch. Stay close. You're trying to get a demo or something. Hopefully, Squishy can take this back. Oh, I missed the boost. Now I'm just like in a bad spot. And he missed the demo. Should be good. Nice save. I think he wants that boost. So I'm just going to wait. Got the boost for me again. I need to, I need to get some boost. It's a fast shot. He did, did miss it, though. Should be all right. Should be okay here. Like, even though I went for that as well, I didn't think Squishy would have it. Should be clear. Hit that fast. Loop out quickly here, too. I'll challenge for him. Yeah, bump over. But that's totally cool because those, those touches off the backboard puts us in a good spot for Squishy to follow it. That sidewall wasn't uh, great, though, because it gives them a chance to have the ball for free. That's super awkward for Squishy now. Good save, though. Round one. I'm being left in a 1v1v2 1v here because uh, Squishy's getting the back corner boost, but I should be able to get just a touch to hopefully stall out a little bit. Good catch. I'm going to wait uh, mid here. I don't know why I go for those. It's a little dangerous to go for in, in, in twos. And I just own cold. <laughs> That's why I don't go for those passes, because they're just going to cut it off every time. It's way too obvious in 2v2. Like, I should just let him cut it and just back off. Like, I know it's not going to be a good play to go for yet. I'm, like, baiting myself into going. Should be all right. Nice. We can save from both of them. I'll just take this back. Back corner should be up in the time. Be awkward for Alpha Cap. Can't get the boost properly. Get the boost. The Alpha Cap should be low here. To be alright, now should be squishy. Alpha Cap's up. Good pop over one. Maybe a double. Beautiful finish. Yeah, so so far I don't think that the boost has really affected like their perception of what I'm going for. It might be harder to see and read what I'm doing, but overall, I'm just trying to play around Squishy and what he's doing. This might be open here. Bit of a miss, but it's okay. It's going to pop up. Go for a double commit touch. So right there, what I'm trying to do is make it so that the double commit comes out from the fact that it's right between both players. I know I can't really get a powerful shot in that position. Like, top right might be possible if I air roll a certain way. But in that position, like, we're just going to get a touch that forces out a bad defensive clear. And let Squishy clean up. I, whenever I play with Squishy, I like to just play around what he's doing. And then just um, be a reliable second second man. Sort of force bad touches. Force touches up to him on the backboard. Etc. Etc. You know how it goes. 2v2 is an interesting game mode. It is uh, very different to 2s and 3s. I would say it's very like unique. Good fake. Very unique experience. Good try. Yeah, I got the backboard. There's a little spooky because he can keep it low. But I didn't get a touch there. I tried to uh, 
force the, the touch off the 12 boost I had. I can't get that. Hopefully that's not a shot on target. Oh, he got it really weak. Hit this to the side to give him the boost and the ball. Good bump. It's fine. It's over Draz's head. It might just be in. I think it is just in. Yeah. Very aggressive push from Draz. When he sees that I have that clear, you have to be very, very careful in those positions. Because it can go all the way over your net just like that. And that one even bounced. Like you can get even more powerful clears in those corner corner positions. Hopefully that's good. I think he can go for this again. I bumped him. Still a good save though. Bump him a little bit. Should be over backboard. Just awkward enough that they can't score. I get the boost as well. Oh, my bad. I got too heavy of a touch there. I'm not trying to cope, but I feel like the um, the boost timing for me is a little weird, considering I can't hear the alpha boost go off the same way. Maybe that's just like me coping. Could be squishy to go for this. I'm going to try and bump him close. Get behind here. All right, that should be fine. Oh, good challenge. I don't have the boost. This boost won't spawn for a second either. I'm going to try and jump now. He's going to go over me. Bumping him. Go left side here. Great shot. Might just be in. Beautiful. Great start. I don't know if the boost has helped. I'm going to say it's a placebo and it definitely helped, but also Squishy played really well. Got some good open shots. Let's move on to the next game. All right, for game number two, we got five up and fearless. It's going to be a very hard game, actually. They're very good twos players. We got to focus up. Let's see if it affects them. I have to go back here. I can't go for the, the touch. It'll be all right. I don't think he can score this. Oh, I did not see Squishy going for that. I thought he was in the, like, in the net, and then he was off the sidewall. Um... Oh, I see. He waited to pre-jump that. All good. Early pressure. Should be all right. Also, Fearless is like way out of the game at this point, so. Hopefully, can turn on this, maybe? He went super early. Good luck. Nice save. Can you get it again? Find the bumps. I back off here. Get the mid boost. Good challenge. Give me a five up in an awkward spot to get a clear. Nice. We'll probably get this, but he's gonna be very low after this touch. So this should be squishy. Be a little bit careful with that because it might be him again. Nice fifty. Should be all right. Maybe five months to maybe go for this. I have 17 boosts. So I'm going to be a little bit careful with this. Oh, he's going to rush it. Oh, my God. I was in such a bad spot there to follow that up with 17 boost because it was such an awkward bounce. It, like, went so high. And even if I jump for that, probably can't make it to the ball. And even if I try to go back, I'm not going to have time. So I just got stuck in a really bad spot. Yeah, it's an annoying touch, but should be fine. Oh, it's just in. Beautiful. I thought I had a flip. I thought I was going to use it. I was trying to catch the ground first to like follow it up. But uh, we get the goal. Maybe that was to do with the boost. I have no idea. They couldn't see what I was doing. Should be all right. I have six boost. I'm in no man's land here. Hopefully I can. Yeah. I'm so stuck with these, these challenges. I'm like, so stuck with no boost. Can't really follow it up and can't really get on the ball. Because I'm put in a position where I'm the, low, the one low boost instead of the one challenging with the low boost. Um, but that's a good play here. I don't... I hopefully can get that. Nah. It's like the setup on the pass is not good. Bumped them. Both players. Can't follow it up though because I'm still very low. Give me a cut here. I'm still very low. Name of the game. Low boost. 
Should be alright. It should be a wall clear here. Of course he turns. They turn on everything. Uh, these two are, are very, very well known for turning on every ball. I'm still alone. Hopefully I can get something here. Oh, nice setup. Good 50. Should be squishy, hopefully. He was pretty wide, so this might be uh, a play for them. I still can't save it. I think we can bring this back. It's just super awkward. Rotations aren't quite there for the two of us. Fifty. I can't follow this, unfortunately. A flip. Totally fine. We can catch this and bring it back in mid, hopefully fast. Nice. Take a bump attempt. The wait here. Realist is up for this. I'm surprised. I'm also surprised by that. Yeah, I'm very surprised they keep being very aggressive like that, over aggressive. Because like those mistakes are gonna come out. I don't know why they're pushing on every ball like that. I guess it's just two v two. Yeah, he's canceling that every time. I'm trying to bump five up here. I can't score, dude. It was open, but unfortunately, squishy missed. Um, get the mid boost. Hopefully, I think he gets that boost, and then we can stay on this ball here. Be all right. This should be Squishy's ball because I think it's awkward for five up the turn. Yeah. Nice, good pass. That's one more, one down. We got three to three to four. Minute eight, we're good. Fifty. I'm trying to force a ball here. I don't know if that gives Squishy the opportunity to go for that. I back off. Unfortunately, that boost's not going to be there for me in time, but. Nice. That was a bad touch for me because it went back to mid, but. Oh, it's both of them. Can you get there? Oh! No way! It's alright. And you can score it, though. Not my best touch to him, but we do get possession. We get challenge, but no one's there. Oh, dude, that's so awkward. Oh my god. 50 across. Squishy went forward, so hopefully I can hit this off the... Cr yeah, he's just gone. <laughs> okay. Not not the best game, but we uh, we made it work. We got, almost got the comeback. I would say that my rotations with Squishy aren't fantastic right now. I feel like I'm a little bit unsure of where to position, but we're making it making it close to the comeback. Those two are very good at twos. All right, and for the last game, we got Pablo and Dot. They're together. I played Pablo before. I obviously don't know who the the Dot guy is, but oh, I skimmed that so fast. But yeah, also, if you don't like Bubbles Boost and you want to use it, um, you can totally like just use ba Baka's mod if you're on PC. Um, it's like totally fine to use use that. Oh, no way. No way. <laughs> I had a feeling. I was like, I'm going to float perfectly with this. Yep. Nice little block. <laughs> We'll take that. I, I'm going to say that maybe he didn't see the bubbles boost. That's coping once again, but that's okay. I should have this for free here. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. I don't, I, <laughs> I guess I'm, I'm just the bubble dunker today. Um, let's do all yours. Let's see if we can make a play here. All good, all good, all good. I don't think he saw. He's probably talking to his chat. 
<laughs> yeah. I assumed. I assumed. He's probably just talking to his chat. I'll go back corner here. Nice challenge. We'll bumped a little bit. I don't think this is a problem, though. Oh, we both got cut off, though. Hopefully, we can get back. Nice touch. That's actually a really good touch so you can follow this up. Nobody's there. Nice follow up. Oh my god, that was actually almost crazy. Should be a 50. It's not going to be a follow up that he can really get to. And if I bump this guy, it should be just open. Nice. Yeah, it was a little scary because obviously if he had more boost, he, like the dot guy probably could have made a touch towards net if he got the right power. It's tough in that position, but I feel like I feel like it is working. The boost is working. I have this back to the right if I can't. Oh, wow. We cut it off. I might just be open again. Beautiful. There it is. Rotations are much cleaner this game. I think also like Fearless and... Um, who was it? Oh, my God. Fearless and whoever was... <laughs> whoever the other guy was. Fearless. Um, oh, and five up. Whoever that... Um, like, they're probably affecting a lot of our decision making, too. He's missing. I might have used a ton of boost to go to the ceiling here. Um, all good. Hit this to myself. Big dunks. I'm trying to bump this guy. Oh, close. It's off target, so Squishy has lots of freedom to do whatever. Oh, I like that. Those are always really strong. Because the one player is chasing to the corner. Hey, yeah, it's a free goal. That's a good, good play. I like those 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 bounce off the backboard because there's a guy chasing into the back corner for the boost, and uh, it's just immediate goal because uh, people don't expect to just go back to net really really quickly. All right, as promised, here's the ion boost that's painted black. This one is not available in the game uh, at base, so you have to find this or uh, trade for it, which doesn't exist anymore. So now you have to actually just wait for it to be in the shop, or I guess it can maybe drop in a regular drop. I have no idea where you can get it, um, but. As you can see, it's pretty pretty clear. And so if I'm backwards like this, you can kind of not really tell. I mean, it's, it's I would say that Bubbles is actually stronger. But here, if I'm boosting like this, you can't really see much. It kind of disappears pretty quickly. Although if you do spam it, you can see it as you go. So Bubbles, I think, is actually a little stronger because of the fact that when you spam your boost, like this or Feather, it doesn't actually show up. But this one does. It's still pretty hard to see, though. So from far away, you can't tell if someone's boosting back or not. Um, and in the air, if you're not close enough to them, it might be pretty difficult to see. Uh, what they're up to but i hope you guys enjoyed the episode um really fun to play with squishy don't play with them too often uh, it is really fun to to kind of play with uh, one of the oldest uh rocket league pros uh, who actually just retired so everyone wish him a happy retirement but either way i hope you guys enjoyed the episode until next time have a great day and i'll catch you guys in the next one